Hi, I'm Michael Choi, and today's video is about the piano by the sea. What does that mean? Where does it come from? Well, basically, I had a goal set in session with the team, and we got down Jed Xavier. He's a great uh, real estate mind coach. So, if you're looking for a real estate coach, talk to him. And this is one of the many ideas and concepts that he brought into our goal setting day and into our lives forever. So, uh, internally grateful, Jed. So, thank you if you're watching this video. Now, the story, I won't say it as good as you, Jed, but basically, the piano by the sea basically is so let's just say uh, there's a beach. Uh, okay, and there's an outdoor restaurant, and it's on the sand. It's on, it's on the sand, and people are fine dining. And then there's this piano uh, that's on the beach, and, and someone asks the waiter, "Excuse me, um, how did you get the piano there? Like, uh, why is it there? And, and, and what's it doing there? And how did you get it down from these rocky cliffs that are all around us? This massive grand piano." And the waiter said, "Oh, someone ordered it." And the consumer, the uh, the person eating at the restaurant that was on, on the sand, they goes, what do you mean someone ordered it? The one said, someone ordered a piano by the sea, so we got them a piano by the sea. And he said, so you just asked, they just asked for it and they got it? Yeah, it's simple. You can ask for whatever you want. What would you like? Anything you like, we can give it to you. You name it, we will give it to you. And, you know, people ask for certain things. So this is about thinking big. It's about... What would you do if you knew you couldn't fail? What would you do if the answer, what would you ask for if you knew the answer would be yes? And it's impossible to get a no. And during this exercise, this is, uh, this is my exercise for the day. It was about our dreams. How big, how big can we dream? And I remember writing, for example, I wrote um, countries. I wrote countries, right? And then I crossed off countries and I wrote own the planet. And then I ended up crossing the planet off and wrote the universe. And you know, you might not be able to see from the camera, so I'll talk about some of them. Teleportation, uh, underwater world, own, um, own and name rivers, visit the bottom of the ocean, time travel, helicopter that can fly upside down. I don't know if that already exists, it might. Uh, create a new universe, cure cancer, extinct animals, back to life. Um, what would you do if things. If it was impossible, um, if you knew that it wasn't impossible, and that it was possible, and this is uh, apparently what uh, Richard Branson does. It, uh, he has his days where he just keeps on thinking big, and this and it, 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 it enlarges your capacity of what is actually possible in your normal life, because the only thing that's stopping us is 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 us, our mentality, uh, what we think we can do, our glass ceiling, our perception of what is actually possible. And this is just a challenge, and it's invigorating, it's empowering to think, okay, what can I do? Piano by the sea, remember that. And so whenever you're thinking about your business, what you're going to do in your business, think big. Because if you miss, if you shoot for the moon, and if you miss, at least you land amongst the stars, the stars of this world. Take care, guys. I hope you enjoyed.